Hello, uh, PE students. If you are um, receiving this email or, or obviously watching this uh, uh, quick little quick little link, uh, it's simply because um, I just wanted to kind of go through our grading process for like, you know, the fact that you you might be missing a week or two or a weekly log or two or maybe more uh, in your your Skyward account or in your grades. And so I'm here to uh, kind of show you how to look at Skyward, maybe from your point of view, and to see if you're missing anything, and then how to go back to Google Classroom and fill in any of those zeros or any gaps that we might have. So I'm on Skyward right now, and I pulled up a student who, who is okay with me kind of showing you um, their grades. So here is... Um, our, first off, we're in term three, and in term three is a nine weeks. So we have nine weekly logs in term three. So you might read all nine of them in your Skyward account. You might be able to look at all nine of them in your Skyward account under assignments. Each weekly log has a max score of 10 points. Now, if you were to go over to, you'll, you'll see your score. And so in, for this particular individual, they've turned in all of their weekly logs. So this person received 10 out of 10 and 10 out of 10. And so all the way up until this last weekly log um, in which they didn't turn it in. And so if this is, is an example of you, maybe you've got maybe more than one zero, maybe you've got two or three or heck, maybe more than that. Who knows? But if you were to go to Skyward and see these zeros and see what week we are, here's how you would fix that if you choose to do so so if you were to go if this student were to go to their google classroom you could see he's there in a third i'm in the 12th grade google classroom or 12th grade pe google classroom they'd go to the classwork section of things and in the classwork section of things you can see all of these weekly logs the same system that you would see over in skyward now this particular person was missing weekly log eight so if they clicked on it and they were to click on this Google form entitled weekly log eight, it would look like something like this once you got on it, okay? And you would go through this weekly log eight in which it has exercise, 30 to 40 minutes of exercise uh, every day of the week. And you would kind of go through this weekly log. And in particular, I'll just give you an example of, let's just say, a Thursday, which was the last day of this week. So you would have some choices that you could have done for PE, which is or options, option one or option two, uh, or even option three. And if you had a personal workout, meaning like you, you didn't choose to do what was provided for you, you had your own personal workout, meaning you, you did your own thing, you could record that down here. Let's just say uh, I went for a 30 a minute walk and run or you know obviously more details can be provided there you would submit this and once you submitted your weekly log eight then I can see what you've done and I'm able to, to have access to that and then look at it analyze it and then take that weekly log all the things that you've done in that weekly log and then I'm able to pull it over and plug it into Skyward and to give you point value in Skyward uh, for that. So I just wanted to make this just to kind of show you how to um, submit weekly logs in your Google Classroom and how they transfer over uh, into Skyward. If you have any questions, shoot me an email.